guys, Tom Nelson from Weldcraft here, and the guys at the factory asked me to come up with 10 things that I love about this hull, and I'm, I'm not sure I can keep it to 10, but we'll, we'll give it a shot. Follow me around the boat, and you'll see what I mean. The source of Weldcraft's smooth ride and great handling is its reverse chime. So we're talking about this surface right here. What this does is gives the boat a tremendous amount of lift. As you're making a turn, that you're gonna get lift on the side that's that's descending into the water column. You're gonna get suction on the side that's going up so you can get a very stable ride. But the best part about reverse chine is when you go hit a wave, that lift that it's created stops the boat from pounding. And anytime you can reduce that, it's gonna keep you fresher all day on the water. Reverse chine, don't buy a boat without it. Dead rise, or the angle of the hull to the water, is a critical factor in determining how the boat rides and performs on the water. Weldcraft measures their dead rise in three different places. 60 degrees at the bow, 30 degrees amidships, transitioning to 20 degrees in the back of the boat. So we have a nice steep entry transitioning to a nice flatter platform on the back, and incidentally, that 20 degrees corresponds to most transducer angles if you're thinking about a through hull transducer installation. A lot of people think the bow is the business end of the boat. To me, it's the transom. You got more going on in the transom than you do everywhere else in the boat. Weldcraft knows this and has taken care of you with lots of great reinforced places to mount your trim tabs, your zincs, and of course, your all important transducers, which are your eyes and your ears underwater. In addition, we have an integrated engine mounting package You've got a, tr a flotation pod that's actually part of the boat. Weldcraft transom, one of my favorite parts of this Weldcraft boat. Any self-respecting hull has to have the ability to shed water off of her decks. If you opt for a boat that doesn't have self-bailing decks, then every drop of water, fish blood, or anything else that hits your deck has to be pumped out by an electrical pump that puts a demand on your electrical system and puts a demand on that pump as well. Wellcraft's exclusive double scupper system will drain the boat from the front or from the back of the deck, no matter what the attitude of the boat is. And when your boat's in the water, that's peace of mind, brother. The Wellcraft Cuddy King has a great double rod tray system. The top tray is perfect size to hold your downrigger balls, your lead, your other equipment. The bottom tray fits longer objects, but the boat gaff hooks, rods, whatever you need. But one of my favorite aspects of the double rod tray system is the fact that the lower rod tray is high enough where it actually captures your toes. And so you got a toe kick that locks you in and keeps you in the boat quite safely, gives you that feeling of security to let you have a very enjoyable time on the water. While we're talking about working at the side of the boat, we have to mention Weldcraft's high sides. A lot of boats out there hit you down low at the knees where it's very easy to lose your balance. Weldcraft sides hit you more at your thighs and let you be safe and hit and are very comfortable with the nice wide pad inside the gunnel. Not, not uncomfortable, but very safe. Weldcraft's high sides not only ensure you have a dry ride on your boat, but make sure everybody stays on your boat at the same time. Any boat has to have great visibility forward for collision avoidance. It's an obvious point, but for somebody like me that's a rear deck troller, I have to have good visibility forward from the back of the boat. Weldcraft sight lines are unparalleled in the industry. By sitting here at the stern station, I have ex excellent visibility forward through the cabin, basically a 180 degree view from this one position. Weldcraft sight lines are absolutely the best in the industry. Fish friendly features, what can I say? You gotta have them to make the boat fish the way you wanna fish. So we got we got a rocket launcher up here. We're gonna hold 10 rods up here, but the combination net and gaff holder is as functional as it is attractive. Like the brim of your favorite cap, Weldcraft's exclusive overhanging brow and forward leaning windshield protects your eyes, shading the sun, and that's gonna reduce glare. It's gonna keep you fresher by the end of the day. But when you get out in the wet stuff, this thing is gonna shed water like water off a duck's back. Storage, you gotta have it on any boat, and I've never seen a boat that has too much of it. 
Weltcraft makes excellent use of their space. We're talking underneath the bunk boards, underneath the seats, and even under the floor, you've got storage for all your gear. And that's what makes a very enjoyable time on board. No matter what your style of fun on the water, Weltcraft's got you covered with completely changeable cabin layout. All the structures inside the cabin are modular, meaning they can come in and be placed in different locations. Just contact your local Weltcraft dealer, they'll get you all set up. Weltcraft boats are only available through quality, trained marine dealers that are certified and trained by the factory. My dealer is Master Marine of Mount Vernon. If they know this hull inside and out, and they'll take good care of you. But there are other great dealers throughout the Western United States and Canada that are going to treat you right. We'll see you on the water in your new Weltcraft.